Hi friends, today's recipe is Shezwan Gobi Manchurian. This recipe is different and more crispy and tasty. First boil red chilies 20. You can use any type of chilies. After boiling for 10 minutes, then cool and grind into a smooth paste. For Shezwan sauce, add oil 5 teaspoon in one kadai, then add one onion nicely chopped and fry for 5 minutes. Then add ginger garlic paste 1 tablespoon each and fry for 5 minutes. And then add grinded chilli paste and fry for some time. Then add tomato sauce 3 tablespoons. I have used hot and sweet sauce here. You can use any tomato sauce. Mix and keep aside. Shezwan sauce is ready. In another kadai add 5 teaspoon of oil and 2 stems of curry leaf. Fry for 2 minutes. Then add 1 onion chopped into big pieces and chopped green chilies 2 to 4. Fry for 10 minutes. And then add capsicum chopped into big pieces. Fry again till it's soft or crunchy as per your taste. And then add prepared shezwan sauce and fry for 5 minutes. Once shezwan sauce is mixed properly, add cleaned and chopped coriander leaves, half cup. Then add salt, half to one teaspoon. Mix and keep aside. For batter, we need maida one cup, corn flour one cup, salt one teaspoon. Then mix for 1 minute. Then add water little by little as needed to make medium consistency. Don't add more water in the beginning. Remember to add little by little water. Mix thoroughly, no lumps should be there. This consistency is perfect for frying gobies. Chop gobies into small pieces and soak in hot water, salt and haldi powder for half an hour. Then add cauliflower pieces to the batter. Mix nicely by which batter should coat each cauliflower properly. And then deep fry cauliflower pieces on high flame for 5 minutes. After 5 minutes, stir for 2 minutes. Either you can stir continuously or occasionally. Then reduce flame to medium and remove gobi and add to the prepared masala. Mix till uh, masala coats fried gobi properly and serve hot. I have shown another type of gobi manchurian in the beginning. I will give link in the description box.